Hello and welcome back to another doodle in my pentalic sketchbook. Today, this doodle is going to be done with an accurate pen. Now, if you're wondering if the pen is accurate, well, yes, it's it's fairly accurate. But that actually happens to be the name of the pen, this blue pen here. They do make them in red, and sometime maybe I'll pick up the red ones. But this doodle is mostly lines and repeating patterns. I had fun doing it. It was kind of like doing an exercise to get through artist block. But I was listening to some podcast talking about science and space and astrophysics and all that. And when I was really young, I was interested in it a lot. But at the time, I couldn't grasp or understand much of what they were talking about. It all seemed very strange to me and complicated. But now as I've gotten older and learned more about it and really paid attention to what they're saying as I've gotten older and more understanding, I find it to be kind of strange in a way how it went from being so mysterious and I was just lost in all the information to where now a lot of it actually makes sense to me. And I was always interested in the whole field of, of physics and astrophysics and studying the stars and space and the universe. But I was always had always had a really hard time with math. And even though I always had a hard time with math, I've, I've still always had an interest in it. I've just always been interested in discovering things, learning new things, seeing what's out there. And sometimes when I'm doodling, I'll add some space-themed doodles and all kinds of strange shapes that seem completely alien. And I'll add those to my doodles. So sometimes when I'm drawing something, depending on the podcast that I'm listening to or the music that I'm listening to, I might end up putting some of that in there. But the podcast was pretty interesting. They were talking about astrophysics and how light is affected by gravity and they were also talking about how the nature of light changes and I don't want to go into too much detail about it and but it was it was pretty interesting and maybe I'll talk about it some more some other time in another video but I just kind of want to talk about that a little bit and give you a little bit of an idea of what I like to listen to while I'm drawing. So I hope you had a good day and thank you for watching and I'll see you later.